Shalom, everybody. I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me back here in Red Flood. Which right now we are going to war with the good old kingdom of Syria, and also um, it's not looking great for Yugoslavia and such. So we'll see what happens with those guys. I hope the Germans don't show up and beat up Jewish people. Anyways, um, we'll see what happens. But as you can tell, the Syrians aren't doing so well. We got quite a few war goals we can use against other people, like the French Mandate of Lebanon, which would be a lot of fun. Um, eventually, ooh. Wait, Basra, no state, no longer a core of Iraq. We get claim gained by Iraq. Wait, return Iraq. Whoa. That's, wait, what? Return Arabia. Al Mahad, Hamad, state, no longer a core of Austria. Oh, we release him. Okay, at first I heard that. So wait, wait, what? Basra, state is no longer a core, but it's a claim, and then you release Iraq. Wait, why would we do that? That doesn't make any sense to me. No longer a core. The claim is gained by Iraq, but they we release it without cores. Why would we do that? Uh, I don't understand. I'm sorry. Also, how's the war going for us? 2,000 versus... I love the Israeli Defense Force. I mean, we're doing great. We could call it our allies in, but... I, I, mm, I don't know. Good luck, guys. Oh, they're doing kind of okay-ish right here. I mean, well, maybe not. Oh, that is not good. Oh, Yugoslavia, please don't lose. They beat Romania, apparently, but... Oh, they're fighting the Greeks, too. Ooh. Ah, but who cares what is going on in Europe when we have Syrians to capture. Or oh, conquer. Not capture. We're not... Ca mm. Anyways, hope you guys are having a pretty good day. we got a couple comments. Oh, we're out of manpower. Oh, that's not good. Uh, that's the case. Uh, we could probably do that and save a little bit of manpower right now. Because all these places, well, they ain't cored. we got some fighters we got. It was pretty nice. Um, someone just died there, but I didn't really pay attention to it, so... Oh, well... Uh, oops, my bad. I keep clicking things too fast. Oh, my fingies. There you go. Cool. Uh, a couple comments. Uh, someone recommends we try uh, Jabotinsky's Israel. Like, my goal, guys, uh, we're still doing Loyal Hawk Command right now, too. But uh, is to do all the past for Israel and Red Flood. So we will do Ben Gurion as well as Jabotinsky eventually. So you have my promise on that. Eventually, my friends. Eventually. Sorry, guys. I don't really care about going to war with all those other folks right now. Europe is burning, and that's okay with us. State media, like we said yesterday, we get some more political power, lose some stability, get some more support, and daily acceleration support. Very nice. Avram Stern. How many divisions did we just kill off? Or oh, 2,000, that's not mad. Uh, six divisions max. Bangladesh declared one Assam, which is fine. 18,000 are dead. 24,000 are dead. That's not enough for Lebanon, but that's okay with us. Thank you, Lebanon. Now we got to figure out what are we going to do with the uh, Egyptians. To the Nile, li promise a liberating alternative. We could do that. We have 136 political power, though. We did go to extensive conscription. We'll probably go even a little bit higher as well. Um, I just don't think we can actually navally invade. Now, if our allies actually are able to do something here, maybe. But I don't think these guys will let us go through. I don't want the French to have to fight these guys at the same time. Which would be pretty darn bad, I'll be honest. But we'll see what happens. <sighs> Atomic research is good. Ah, yes. Science. Science. Actually, do we have... What do we have on our divisions? Who are we even using here? 20s? Yeah, they're turning combo with, which is not bad. Ah, yes. So, support companies are looking not great. <laughs> Guns looking great. Artillery's looking okay. Anti-air. Yeah, we don't have a lot of stuff here. We have some motorized, but other than that, not too much. Um, ah, we need to do this one first, though. To the Nile. I wish they would give the Suez Canal back, but... You know, we can call our allies in and see what happens. Let's try that. It would help if I gave him orders. Go, go, go. See what you can do. We have no navy here. Hopefully the French are patrolling those. So we can naval invade other people. If not, we all hope that the French will invade. Oh. Oh, I forgot about this too. They're on this side too. Oh, whoops. I should actually send them up over here. Whoops, my bad. Oh, they got some divisions over here we can kill off too. Oh, we can't see this now. No. There's only like six, seven divisions here. One, two, three, five. Five plus three is usually eight sometimes. And they died. Not bad. We could risk going over here. I don't know how big the Egyptian Navy is, though. We're going to risk it once. Let's risk it once. Tel Aviv? Ah, oh, we love Tel Aviv. Um, anything else around here? Not really. Seize. Oh! Oh, we can start a border war. Oh, okay. That's a, that's different. I like that. I really like that, actually. So we're going to risk it anyways. I mean, it's only four divisions. If they die, then that's my fault, but whatever. Go, boys, go! The Egyptian Navy is probably not that big. Yeah, it's not big at all. <laughs> Yay! All right, baby, let's see Suez. Ah, more arty. Thank you very much. Sure, we'll do that because we have five research slots. More chaos. 
Oh, just gun him down, baby. Just gun him down. What do we do with our enemies? We just gun, gun, gun. I assume people would say, I guess, gas? I don't know. Ah, oh, do we actually, were we actually defeated there? Bro, don't lose Benghazi. At least don't lose Benghazi. Don't. Hold your tuckuses together, my fellow well, attrition sucking soldiers. But romanticize death. I brought this yesterday, so if you want to build this, please go ahead again. Yeah, just kind of hang out. Don't take too much attrition. Are we starting the border war or what? Oh, two days. Okay. Let's see what happens. Ah, uh, they do have some divisions there. That is not good. Hello? Did we win? Did we lose? What's going on? I mean, we could justify on it just in case, anyways. XTD is not bad, but still. Uh, this guy's hopefully taking a lot of its damage from us. I would love to see how much damage we've done, but obviously we cannot, which sucks. What happened to the border war? I guess, is the UK at war? Oh my gosh, Germany, no. Germany, no. Oh, that sucks. There's nothing we can really do about this. Um, how much manpower do you have, Germany? Suit? Let me see suit. Oh. Not that much. You guys have a lot of manpower, though. Guys, please. Don't lose. Come on. Come on, please. I just want a successful Jewish campaign here. Please. Please. Yugoslavia, why? This sucks, man. This real sucks. What happened to the border war? I was promised a border war, and they lied to us. I might just go to war with them, but then again, that's going to kill us off, probably, because they have stuff over here. Um, they got stuff over here. Oh, boy. Airplanes are nice. Mm, we have nothing really there to do. Happy 1941, though, everyone. Hope you're having a great year. Uh, yeah. We'll see what happens. You know what? We can send them over here, probably, too. Come on over, boys. We're gonna push this side. Hopefully they don't alienate us, too, but whatever. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. The border war did nothing. Literally nothing. Also, I didn't realize that after this one, like... This sets stability to 100%, which is really nice, but whatever, I guess. Whatever. 41, get some more construction speed because we can. Please don't lose. Please don't lose. But anyways, uh, New Levant. Oh, we need the Suez Canal, so we can't do that one yet. We'll do Purge Rabbis. Might as well, right? You get more accelerationism, less... Oh, okay. Uh, less reactionism, more, less political power, and less stability, but we'll do the best we can. You know, do the best we can. Amatos of Zion. Very nice, very nice. All right, the boys are there. Go ahead when you can. Get rid of every last Egyptian you can, man. All right. Any other... Oh, we actually do have some planes here. That's actually really nice. Very nice. Oh, we can kamikaze them, but I don't think we will this time. Maybe next time, but not right now. Ah, yes. I love my Jewish casts. How often... I wonder what... Hmm. Modern-day Israel. I wonder what they use. I think we could go to war with them, but now we have to completely open, which is probably not a good idea, but whatever. You know, it is what it is. Um, sure, grab that because you can. Honestly, we're doing kind of well over here anyways. Oh my gosh, that looks so bad. Germany, Germany, stop, stop. I thought Germany was supposed to be weak in this mod. Apparently not. Apparently they're really not weak at all. Unless France is just really bad. Maybe France is really bad. But then again, these guys are still holding out down here, but still. Did they buff them or something? I have no idea. Um, they're still attacking us like crazy. We're still... I yeah, can't quite win there yet. Come on, how much manpower have we killed off? We must have killed off a lot of manpower. Oh, uh, they're up to extensive conscription. they got to be running out of equipment too, right? Oh, let's take a look here. We have no spies? We need an intelligence agency, my friend. Go into. At this point, you know, just full front line it. This is really bad for supply and such, but whatever. There's nothing else we can do. we got to push through here anyways. I want to push through here all the way, kill off Egypt, and then take out the Suez. Just because I think that would be for the best for us. How do we purge rabbis? The new priesthood? Yes. More accelerationism, more stability, more support. Very good, very good, very good. Um, this won't really matter too much, so I guess we do that one. That's fine. Mm, small ship stuff? Get some research speed, I guess. Might as well, right? This is looking so bad for us. Purge the rabbis. Ah, oh, that sucks. Hey, hey, good look. Nice, nice, nice. Sorry, guys. Even if I come in, it means absolutely nothing because I can't do anything against the Germans. The Germans are very strong for some reason. Hopefully, you're becoming a desert fox and a logistics wizard or an organizer or whatever. Oh, you already are an organizer. You already are a logistics wizard. That's not enough, though. More. More. Nice. So we can get a spy that's going to uproot some more entrenchment. 
Which would be very, very good. Guys, come on. I know supply sucks. Force the attack. Force it, force it, force it, force it. You've got to win. You've literally got to win here. There is no giving up. Ten divisions. My god. Are you kidding me, man? This is stupid. I mean, we're taking so many casualties for nothing at this point. Okay, get out. We're going to war, war, war with Britain on the side then. You guys can stay here and die if you want. If you don't want to win, if you don't want a greater Israel, then you're going to just die here. You're going to die anyways, but you know, whatever. Just go die then. Stupid divisions. Pieces of garbage. Worthless. Absolutely worthless. Get out. Yeah. Force defense. Either you win or die. Like I'm not. I'm not playing games here with this. With these groups now. All right. No, I don't care about this stuff. I'm sorry. I don't. And do that one. No more millies. Uh, that would be pretty really good to do as well. And we're gonna need 70 of you guys, like allies. My gosh, there's so many spots here. UK. Seriously, that's so dumb. Get a life, UK. Get a life. God, seriously, why is Germany so strong? That's ridiculous. Uh, go and raise the conscription level again. Oh, that's. Oh, we're not even in war economy. Okay, we'll do that next time. Give some time for our guys to move over there. Back in those offensives. Oh, we can't do this one either? Oh my god, this is dumb. This is really stupid. But I guess we'll do the foundation of the Nasset. Ha Nasset, or the Great Assembly, is the main house of the government of Israel. Owing its history to the ancient religious Nasset, or traditional gathering of wise men and prophets, the modern Nasset carries, carries its legacy of an assembly of leaders. It is to be the legislative branch of government, with oversight for over most of Israel politics. Over the, most of the politics of Israel. I guess down there, we should be able to do okay, right? Holy crap. Yeah, we're not going to do okay here. Yeah, we got screwed over. Um, honestly, I'm probably going to do some stuff off screen right here, just to make sure that France does not... Yeah, this is dumb. I'm going to go... I'll be right back, and we're going to make sure that this does not happen like this. Again, the great returning. What is it to say to an approaching tsunami? What can be added with words to a coming earthquake? All that can be done is to describe, or try to describe very well. The bless, bless be he who gives in peace what he once gave in war, for once the twelve great boulders of Jacob marched to fulfill his promise over the dry bed of Jordan with fire on the edge of the sword. And now the innumerable branches of Judah and Benjamin are gathered in, to be one people in peace once again in the land of the promise. But bottom, button text. So the Lord gave Israel all the land which he had sworn to give to our fathers, and they possessed and lived in it, because they had just finished this one and did all of term. It is hereby law in Israel. Every Jew has a right to come to this country as an Ola, or an immigrant. Alright, so right now, um, it's gonna be really bad, but, uh, I'll be honest, like, I had to use cons commands, because I had to give France a fighting chance, as well as Italy and Yugoslavia, to just survive against the Germans, so, like, I, I'll be honest, like, I had to use cons commands, which sucks, but I don't know why, but the French are just extremely weak, and we're gonna need the French, because right now I'm sick of waiting, we're gonna go to war with the, uh, these guys too, so. Oh, well, I guess we have to wait first. God dang it, we gotta wait 60 days, my bad. Um, it's fine, whatever. Let's go do, uh, the six Alia. Cool. But yeah, it sucks. I don't know. I don't understand why. Why are the French so weak in this mod? Why are they so ungodly weak? They always die in my campaigns, it seems like, to uh, Germany, which sucks. So, My apologies. I don't like using um, cons commands, but we just had to. So, Also, uh, I did try to make some of these guys 40 combo with, but they're looking okay. But now we're like, <laughs> we have a lot of guns. We have a lot of guns that we took over. And also, to take out Egypt, it wasn't really too bad. As long as you just hold a line and there's just like Navy invading El, Al El Alamein. Invade there. Actually, I invaded Alexandria and then went down here to a naval invade and then killed all these guys off. So it's actually not too bad, but I forget about that sometimes. Oh, hello. I thought they had divisions in here. But as you can see, we're, we're, we're pretty much poised to go. Um, this was going to suck just because they have uh, the Commonwealth. Oh, there goes China. The Commonwealth over here, Commonwealth over here, Commonwealth over here. So obviously, they don't really care too much, now, do they? Actually, per Iran. What's going on with Iran? Uh, Arya Mer. So be it. Commonwealth is down here too. And, oh, the Bayong government's fighting Andui Clique and the United Republican Front? Oh, you guys are fighting. Oh, you have none. Hmm. Alright, well. Alright. Whatever. Also, we can return to Egypt, but we need... Wait. We need... Wait, Mali? Why do we need Mali? Okay, this is definitely bugged or something. Like, Red Flood is not 100% there yet. It's close, but, like, that's, that's Mali, right? Or Mali? Is it, is it this one? No, that's still Mali. Yeah, there's only... 
That must be some, a bug or something. Because why would we need that part of the country to give that back to? Okay. Um. Actually, how long of a focus was that? I can't really tell. Uh, expand Jewish agencies. Uh, that's not bad. That's actually really strong. I like that one. No one left behind. Mainstream Hebrew. As many Jews arriving in Israel do not speak Hebrew fluently, efforts must be made to promote literacy and fluency, making the ancient tongue the unifying language of our desperate people. Oh, hello. Oh, they're down here too. Oh, wait. Do we own this? Oh, that's a French. That's a French. I guess we can go to work. Oh, because I click on the button. There you go. That makes it better. Cool. Ah, uh, see, now that they've shown up now. Which sucks, because uh, to do this, we're going to need... I want to do all this stuff. Like, I don't care if we have to use console commands for this, a campaign like this. So... And honestly, it's really... I don't like it that the UK has literally nothing to do until it goes to war with, like, the French or the Germans, so... Uh, we're gonna need you guys down here, too, so... Let's go there. There you go. Hmm... That'll be okay for now. Uh, yeah. I don't like how the UK just literally does nothing until they kill someone else off and turn the tide against someone else, which I just don't like. just don't like it. We should do okay here. I mean, some of these guys are okay. Oh, we have no manpower, but what if we made some of these guys, like, 40 combo with? Actually, how much support equipment do we have? Not much. Not much. We have some anti here, which is nice. Improve rubber processing, because I do want to throw in some logistic companies, just so I'm on anyways. I don't care at this point. Uh, what else do we have here? Anything here? No? Rubber? Because we can't. Why not? I want... Okay. Alright, so maybe I use cons commands too much. So I'll be honest, like, I use cons commands, but honestly, like, we need a strong France to help us out here against the, the UK. Because I don't understand why the French are so ungodly weak in Red Flood. They're really weak. They're not that difficult to take out. And even the AI can take them out with what? So it's just hungry and that's it. So I'm going to wait. Uh, do I want to wait? Uh, they can take them out anyways. Give it a little more time. Uh, I think I did this one last time. So Ben Yadua approach. Throughout his life, famous Alex lexographer Ben Yehuda popularized the regular use of Hebrew between the issue communities. He was a visionary, loyal to the dreams of Zion. The reincarnation of the Hebrew language is a mass feat, indicative of the willingness of the people to abandon the languages of the diaspora and once again fully commit to their native tongues. Yes, very good. Um, so yeah, I saw, I'm sorry that I use cons commands, but it is what it is. I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. I just, I want to make sure we do okay here, so. And that means Germany dying, so be it. So be it, thank God. Yeah, don't, just... I was told for a long while. Maybe it was this one. Maybe it's Führerreich. The Germany's really weak. I think maybe it was Führerreich. Maybe not this one, but I don't know. Just France is really weak in this mod. Despite them being really cool accelerationists. Yeah. 40 combos, not bad. Logistics. How, how bad are we out right now? Artillery's really bad. Oh, centralized fire control is really good, though. Can I please just finish off Germany, please? Please. Please. And Tamari is still there. They should take out Denmark, I suppose. But it should be that bad left, right? Do they have divisions down here? Because we need to keep all these areas. You know what? Let's finish this focus first. And then we'll go to war. So this way we can get the Suez Canal, hopefully pretty quickly, so we can do a new Levant. We remade the region into our image. It's time to rid our foes of the delusions and proclaim this land is ours. Which would be very good. We should be able to go to war. Uh, you know what? We'll go to war first by ourselves and we'll call them in. Screw it. If this goes badly, then whatever. Give us our territory back, you pieces of garbage. Force the attack. Kill them all off. Because I do know there's another opening down south as well. Miles Dempsey, it is what it is, and there you go. Uh, well, I should have waited for that, but whatever. Um, I'm going to send you guys down here, maybe. But I'm going to do like this, and actually give half you guys here, because you guys need to help take this area out, too. So, that'll be good. And go in. Just, just go in. Just go straight on in. I don't want to call on the French just yet, because they have to finish this work against the Germans first before we do anything else. I, I just got tired of waiting, I'll be honest. I'm just tired of waiting. I just want you to hold. Don't attack, don't attack, don't attack. Just hold, 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 hold. Actually. Attack them for now, because I don't know if they're moving in or not. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's good. Okay, the UK, UK went to war with Japan. That's good. That's good to see. Very good. Okay, go into. Just because I, I don't want to wait any longer. I just don't. I just do not want to wait any longer. Yeah, but... They need to go to war with someone else than just Japan. They really do. What is America doing, actually? The other United Technics led under Howard Scott. Not doing much, huh? Okay, did they actually win? Okay, they actually won. Thank God. Uh, just my apologies. I hate using cons commands in this mod. Hey, we can actually use this though. But, like, it, it sucks. It really sucks. I mean, of course, this is kind of a meme path with Israel, but, you know, whatever. Force the attack. I want them dead. I want every last single last one of them dead. Alright, so now we should be able to do a new Levant. Creator Israel is our new reality. But I'm not gonna, like, 
waste time with just trying to do this 100% legitly because I don't have a ton of time and it's just stupid. It's just incredibly stupid. Why does France have to die to Germany every campaign? I mean, seriously. They need a buff. They really do need a buff. Or nerf to Germany. I don't know which one. Or neither. Or both. They just, they just always die in every campaign I do. Every campaign. I guess this is historical, huh? 42. Grab some more engineers. Because I don't want to deal with the UK. I just want to focus on the Middle East. That's all I want. And because we're forced to join Third International, basically. For this, this you know, path. Hmm. Not good. Come on, guys. Keep going. You're not going to give up. I don't want to fight the UK. I do not want to fight the UK. I just wanted the Suez Canal. And of course, I guess part of the problem is that I'm okay with, UK, with French dying, but the border war does not work. The border war does not work. I would not have had to do anything with France to keep them alive. If France could die, I don't care. But if we get, get the Suez Canal, that, sh that should have worked. That should have worked. So, you know... I guess it is what it is, but... Oh, yeah. Service by requirement. Thank you. Should have worked, but I guess not. Uh, losses? We've lost quite a few guys to the UK. We've got off quite a few of them, too, so that's not too bad. Alright, the series is gone. That's fine. Uh, forcing stability. Six, unity. The unification of the nation under the banner of Hebrew freedom. Through individual brilliance and the collective devotion to, of the war of liberation, we will be unified. Yeah, that sucks. If only the thing worked, we would not I'd have gone to war with the UK. Actually, how's it going? Did they get invaded yet? No, they're probably losing a lot of ships, though. I want to see what Russia's up to, though. China, UK, uh, Japan. Oh, the Far East Republic is here. Air production. We need definitely some more manpower. My god. I mean, it's so unfair that we have to fight the UK. They need to fight someone other than Japan. It's, they really do. They really, really, really do. <sighs> Philippines, cool. A new Levant, forcing stability. We can build a third temple as well. We have Greater Israel, which is nice. But, you know, I feel justified in using Collins' commands just because I didn't work as intended, so. Um, okay, we're Great Nose, Greater Israel, but we still have a lot of resistance here, so. Can we... There's nothing else we can do about that? The third temple. Hmm. Construction of the third temple may begin. That sounds like we need to do time with that, or spend some time with this one first, so. For now, I'll just hold off for now. Well, unless you're winning. Then it's okay to move. Or not. You guys suck. I know they're tanks, but still. Um, overall, not too bad, actually. Hello. Well, if you want to attack down there, we can probably split you guys up right here. Which would be very good. Oh we, can, oh, we can do this. Okay, so we do get cores eventually. That's actually really nice. I'm glad we can see that. But we don't have enough manpower, so that really sucks. Uh, if I have to delete division, so be it. So, there you go. 12,000. Oh, that's not enough. Oh, that is not enough for the settlement in Lebanon. Uh, how, much people live, how many people live in Lebanon? So, I like that, but, you know, I just wish there wasn't a bug. Sinai? How many people live in Sinai? I, yeah, not much. Lebanon is probably the best bet. The Suez Canal uh, versus Basra. Basra might actually have a lot. That's like no one there. Basra might have a lot. No, let's do Lebanon. Lebanon's better. Save our manpower. There we go. That'd be nice. Fuel refining is very good as well. But yeah, I don't like that. I don't like the bugs, man. The bugs. The bugs no good. Bugs no bueno. At this point, just go ahead. Just, just go ahead. Guys, guys, there's something easier to do. Don't just brute force them. Just go around them if you can. Alright. Beudens, yes. Oh, look at that. We have some manpower. Even more manpower. Oh, Syria would be really good at core. Oh, now we're out of manpower. I guess we just gotta keep an eye on it. Since we are mobilizing more, which is really nice. Of course, these guys are sucking up some manpower too, so that's actually really good, just in case. So this way we can just apply as soon as we need to if we want to, so... Are we winning in these different areas, or what's going on? No? Yes? No? It's, it's a mixed bag. Alright, engineers are nice. Get some better recon. Or maybe not recon, actually. Logistics. Oh, good. Good. We have no resources, though, to use. Hmm. Pulsing stability. 
Oh, it was what? The stuff? Yes. Attacking and piercing. You're good. You're good. Hey, not bad. Die, you stupid British soldiers. Die, 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 die. You don't deserve to be here. You really don't. Because of your bugginess, we have to, like, use God's commands for that. Like I said before, I hate it. Third temple, though. Third temple. I hope this goes well for us. What if we cancel all these guys? 40,000 is not bad. I do want to course Syria, though, but... Hmm, Jordan? Egypt. Oh, let's score Egypt. That'd be nice. Go! Go to just go and kill them all off. Let God set them up. Uh, do these get Hello? Oh, they died. What is this? They request... What do you, what do you mean you want manpower from us? We're... We're, we're Israel! What? If anything, we're asking, we should ask manpower of you, you ding-dongs. Actually, can you get manpower from these guys? Hold on. Yugoslavia, do you have any manpower? You guys are all garbage. <laughs> we're flipping Israel. We're taking literally the entire Middle East out. What do you mean you can't give us manpower? Go in. Seriously. Go in. Doesn't matter if you win or die. Oh, look at that. Yes. 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 Oh. Wait. Where did we get that manpower from? Uh. Hold on. Hold the phone. Lend lease. Uh. It must be because we court other divisions. Nice. Very nice. Okay, that makes me feel better now. Come on, guys. I know it's mountains. Just please kill them off. But hey, recording stuff. This is pretty nice. Pretty nice. Board observers. And I apologize if I turn it slightly ragey for this campaign. Just, uh, It's just frustrating when things don't work. I don't want to go to war with the UK. I want the things to work correctly. We could have easily gotten the border war because the guys are all literally 20 combat with eh, Costa Rica. But it just wasn't in the cards. So we don't have manpower now. Uh, you guys, except for you. Yep. I got the manpower for it. Get ready. We have no equipment now. Iran's looking pretty good, though. I like what the Iranians are doing with their stuff. Maybe we're the Turks. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, uh, sure, guys. Sure. Oh, look at all these people want to give us stuff. Nice. So, I wonder what the Third Temple is going to be like. Fortify our land. Might do that next. <clears throat> And come on! Oh my God, that takes so long to do. But hey, that's the really nice stuff we got now. Uh, 100%. Why not? Third temple. The third temple of Jerusalem unveiled. The greatest project to the Jewish faith has finally been revealed to the beginning to begin in Jerusalem. The third temple of Jerusalem, the first one being destroyed by the Neo Babylonians and the second destroyed by the Romans, has been finished. After many years of planning by the Zionist authorities during brutal occupation in Jerusalem, the glowing marble of the greatest eschatological project in Christianity and the ultimate insult for Muslims has finally been unveiled to begin and at the same time be made unbreakable through a network of defenses across the country by the kingdom of greater Israel which spreads by the Cairo to the Basra. Whilst these news have been met with a general uprising by the remaining Arabs in the kingdom they've all been brutally repressed by fresh conscripts arriving from all over the world all united in their belief in the Jewish state and their ethnic origin in the 12 tribes of Israel. Outside of the grasp of Israel's authority though several Muslim populations have been agitating for a war to undo the upfront to their religion to the point where thousands of Muslims are already arriving as mercenaries illegally through Libya and Persia to attack the Israeli state and its few allies in the world. Being that the state has found itself ever more a pariah in the international relations, and yet nothing seems to stop the Jewish resolve which brutally destroys and dismantles any resistance, slowly but surely grinding the Arabs into dust. Is this the beginning of the end? I want to build the temple. West Bank, it's more manpower. Oh, nice. Very cool. Yeah, these people don't get the freedom. Um, I don't know, let's see what happens. How are we doing over here? We're doing okay against the Turks? Greater Israel is not great enough. We want more. More Israel. Is this? Yeah, it's all cord. Well, not all of it, but a good chunk of it is. We want more cores. More cores. You guys should easily be able to take these guys out. They're just horse dudes. Alright. Okay, and them civvies. Very nice, very nice. We might want to boost this up a little bit more here. And yeah, so we'll take some more stuff. Cool. So after the fortify our land. I guess we've reviewed diplomacy, revived diplomacy. 
The Leahy's moves against Israel meets traitors and outside threats has made an international pariah to all but the League Solar. It, it is time this changed. Like-minded governments must see that we are a legitimate member of the Global Circle for Nation. National self-determination! Alright everyone, so right now we have one day until the third temple has been built and what's going to happen? Well, hope, hopefully something does happen, but we just built the third temple, which is really nice. But in the meantime, I had to send people down back down to the peninsula here because the UK did invade. We're doing and holding here in Khartoum, okay? Not really much is happening. I still want to go to war with the Turks just because, why not? And things are just pretty much at a standstill. But we are currently doing and finishing off reviving diplomacy. Um, I think I read this one, so if you want to read it again, please go ahead. Israel will attempt to reach out into the world. So that this part will pretty much conclude the unique part of this campaign for this focus tree. Um... I don't know. With the uh, oh, repatriation program. Uh, third temple being built was cool and all, but I don't know. I kind of wish it was a little bit more. Something about the third temple. Something really cool like, oh no, we're going to end the world. Or, you know, like, oh, here comes God. Or maybe get like some more stability. Get some more war support. Something like that. Or maybe get maybe uh, more building slots. That'd be really cool, I think. But expand the Jewish agency. In order to properly process the increased number of Jews coming to Israel, the Jewish agency needs significant expansion, with design or the designated branches for given regions and groups. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, we can do diplomatic missions. Oh, look at this. Okay, so we can okay, so this helps each other then. Um increase opinion. And they get stuff, we get stuff. Cool. Infrastructure. Uh mission Italy. Uh actually let's do this one first. And then we'll do the Italians. And we're still going down strategic bombing. Uh though this side, which is kind of weird, but whatever. No, let me go to war with those guys too. Um, is there any point not to? Can they actually attack us? Can we actually win here? I don't know, that's probably a good question to ask before we actually go to war. But hey, we'll see what happens. Uh, we might maybe be able to. Cool. Uh, Italy, and then uh, France, of course, Spain, Ethiopia, or DT Ethiopia, and Yugoslavia. Might as well. We got all that peepee, -pee, right? Might as well do it. Can we actually win here? That'd be kind of kind of nice if we could, but then again, someone just in, wait, wait. What happened there? Did we give him territory? I don't remember doing that, but okay, sure. Why not? Do we actually win? No, we did not. Well, that sucks. That really sucks. It says you guys could win, but I kind of don't trust that now. Uh, let these guys move around a little bit more. That's pretty weak right there. We actually might be able to win right here, maybe. If not, I mean, I'm only doing this just to see if we can do anything else here. Uh, I mean, Turkey's fun and all, but I just want to beat him up just a little bit. Just a little bit. Now we're actually winning it over here, too, but that doesn't seem to make too much sense, but whatever, you know. Um, yeah. Too bad America doesn't really do too much in this mod. I mean, you can, you can completely collapse, which is kind of cool, but still. Can we just win? I want to win one battle. I just want to win a single battle, please. Just one battle. One battle, please. Uh... I'm sorry, France, but we don't got the manpower to spare. Oh, I guess technically we do. But, uh, actually, at this point, we're kind of not too small either in terms of manpower and territory. So, I don't think... No, nothing's really happening over here, so... Um, yeah. Can we actually win? That'd be kind of nice if we could win. Do we have any planes? We should have some air superiority here, you know. Yeah, we do. They have a few planes as well, which makes sense. Um, yeah, not bad. We're doing some ground damage as well, which is very, very nice. How strong are the Turks? That is a good question to ask. Actually, ten. Oh, that's not. That's not. That's a very little manpower, actually. Let's take a look. You help us in entrenchment and figure out what they have. That'd be very, very good. Ah, we're doing relatively okay though, even though they are taking out this area a little bit. But that's all right. I think I'll puppet them. I want to puppet Turkish people. Go at war economy. Uh, actually, let's go down to extensive conscription. I don't get hit too much harder uh, with the stuff with the debuffs. So nice, nice, nice. There, make three more. Three more, cause you can. Expand the Jewish agency and improve immigration from Germany. Why not? Also, uh, since we're kind of here, and the campaign is kind of winding down. Um, let's do this as well. That'd be kind of good. We can do this too. Here are a lot of the focuses. If you want to read them, please go right ahead. And there we go. Boom. Because I've already read this before, technically. So let's do it again right there. And there you go. There you go. As well as, I uh, got that one, Immigration from Poland, from Ethiopia, the G New Jewish Man, which seems actually really cool. That's actually pretty darn strong. Uh, let's see, we also have No One Left Behind. Uh, give funds to the He Halutz. We have this one, Conclude the Exodus from France, Our Brothers to the South, Return from America, Nationalized Businesses, Infiltrate Ethiopia, Covert Transport Fleet, Ethiopian Militias, Fight for Beta Israel, Build Schools, Build Roads, 
reunite with our brothers. Very cool stuff. And fun urbanization, too. So, not too bad. Uh, hopefully, we just win. Uh, we'll make this a little last little piece of our uh, little campaign here. Too bad we can't really do too much. Like I said earlier. And I apologize if I was seeing a little rant here, just kind of hitting the same pots over and over again like I do often, like I'm doing right now. But I, did, I didn't want to do this, man. I did not want to go to war with these guys. Oh, well, random. How are we doing this war? Wow. We've lost a lot against the UK. We've done pretty good against them, too, as well, though. Um, Japan. Oh, they're fighting the Japanese, too. That makes sense. Which is nice, but that's not enough for the UK. Honestly, for Japan versus the Commonwealth, it's kind of fair-ish, maybe? I know Japan got involved with a lot of stuff, but... No, no that, just, that doesn't excite me as much as it could for other things. Uh, Turkey has lost quite a few guys. We've cut off 78,000 of them. Almost 80,000 of them ourselves, but... We'll see. Hey, cut them off. Cut them between. Yay, yay, yay. Not bad. I am excited for the other two Jewish paths, though. See what they can do. Planes, please. Ace pilot promoter, very nice. We do have air superiority, which is very nice. 1.2 damage. Considering that we're Israel, and greater Israel. Actually, do we? We don't have claims on this group, which sucks, but yeah, we did have agreement with these other guys. Reader interception is fine. Go into that one, too. They came from the Scarlet Empire. Germany, a mighty land with an equally eye on hand, and how they dealt with the Jewry has created a sort of friendship with them, at least nominally. <clears throat> Uh, yet many Jews find themselves desiring to come to the promised Zionist homeland, believing that dying for a socialist republic, especially as formerly high-class society members, would be against their beliefs. Thus, many have been doing an exodus to Israel since we've appeared on the map. Entrepreneurship is key. The revival of Hebrew is part of a greater idea. The restoration of cultural unity between the Jewish people. It's a great misjustice to continue and view our people on desperate lines Sephardi, Ashkenazi, Mizari, or Mizra, or Mizrahi. The arbitrary division between the Jewish people must be amended to promote a single united people. Capable of black tackling the challenges of a single unit. Cool. And I know we're leaving this empty here, but we should be able to beat these guys up pretty easily. Uh, well, maybe not easily, but we should be able to do it. They're out of manpower anyway, so. And gun wise, how are they doing? Ah, uh, they're doing okay. They got plenty of equipment. They got plenty of equipment, unlike us, which we have no artillery. Other than that, we're looking actually really good at everything else. Actually, looking quite good. That's okay. Let's get some of this. Because we can. You guys still hanging out, having a good old time? I did actually make the Mountaineers 40 combo with, but whatever. Yeah, not bad. Oh, do we have more? Oh, we do have another research shop. Nice. Military police, because we can, because why not? Yeah, I don't know. Building the third temple. I wish there was more for it. Like, uh, that'd be really cool if we build the third temple and be like, alright, well, we won. Or, you know, get some more construction slots. More building speed. I mean, obviously, there's no such thing as prestige in Hoi 4, at least for right now, but like, and I don't think there ever will be one, but still. Ismint is gone. And we got Turkey! Um, honestly. I didn't say I want to puppet them. But annexing them might be a little bit more cool. You know what? We're, we, we've annexed everything else here. My apologies. Well, there's not really much else here. And I apologize once again for using cons commands. It is what it is, but... I mean, there's literally nothing else I could do about it, so... It's weird that Iran got these, like, Kuwait and this area. Was, was that, is that Abu Dhabi or something? So that's very, very weird to see, but... Uh, there's really nothing else here for us to do. Oh, I think I already showed you everything here. So, hey, if you enjoy the video and campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great, great rest of your day.